He escaped into the castle. Damn, he got away. Chosen, I'm sorry. Please prepare yourself. Ah! Ah! It's an angel. An angel has come down from heaven. It's the second coming of Spiritua. Look, your heretical deeds have brought down an emissary of Crucius. Chosen one, then this must truly be... Yeah, she is the angel of death and destruction. Spiritual has returned. Please forgive us, oh great angel. Uh, uh, um, what should I do? Hey, what's going on? Don't worry and just follow my lead. Oh, holy angel, how shall we deal with these creatures? Colette, say you're going to kill them, but... It's okay, just say it like you're in command. Uh, um, die! Please forgive us! Oh, holy one. Please spare their lives in my name. I will defeat those... Or those who oppose you and once again act as the chosen to spread the teaching of Martel. Please. Say so you'll forgive them. Okay, I shall forgive you. Did you hear that? The angel has recognized the chosen as the true holy will of the church. Leave at once and capture my enemies, the Pope and his private soldiers, the Papal Knights. Yes, sir. Broke the wanted status of the chosen and his companions at once. Yes, sir. Everyone do as the chosen commands. Damn, and they left with the quickness. Oh, well, everyone did what you said, Zelos. You were saved by the legend of Spiritua. Is that related to Spiritua, the ch Chosen of Silveron? Beats me. If you want the details, go read the books in the church or something. Anyway, Spiritua is famous for saving a Chosen by killing a king who tried to dispose of the Chosen. Hmm, kind of like what's going on now. Does that mean they won't be chasing us anymore? The church should be fine in now, anyway. What's left is his majesty. We need to let him know that he's been poisoned. Spiritual Reborn. Hilda. Wait! Princess, let us see his majesty. I don't know anything about the return of Spiritual, but my father is sick. My father only wanted to protect Tethiala. We know. Are you aware that his majesty has been poisoned by the Pope? That can't be. It's true, the Pope has run away upon being investigated for it. We must hurry and neutralize the poison. Please move. Looks like this is definitely the antidote. Oh, hmm. Father. Oh, uh, what? Looks like he's regained consciousness. Your Majesty, do you recognize me? The traitor, Zelos, have you come to kill me? No, Zelos saved you. Traitor, yes, that does suit me. Anyway, we were set up by the Pope. We have no intention of harming Tethayala. Even if the ruling family were to doubt him, the church... Soldiers and citizens will surely side with Zelos the Chosen. We have the return of Spiritual with us, after all. What do you want? You want to see the documents concerning the hero Mythos and the Carlon War that are maintained by the royal family. They are stored in the archive on the second floor. Do what you will with them. Do not show yourselves in front of me again. I am tired. I want nothing more to do with the church's power struggles. You're just being selfish. It's alright, kid. Then, Your Majesty, we shall allow ourselves access. All right, so we leave. Is it in here? I think so. Yeah, it's loading. All right, let's start looking through the books. Literally, everybody's looking through the books. It's no use! I can't believe we searched through all this and still haven't found it. Are there any other books? I'm not going to give up. There has to be a way. Lloyd, thank you, but it's okay. You can stop. Whoop! And all the books scattered. That's a big-ass book. This angelic language? No, they're ancient elven letters. Wait, this may be it. I certainly didn't expect the, to find the book that way. Let's clumsiness seems to truly be blessed. Professor, what does it say? Wait, in order to prevent the erosion of the Crucius Crystal, a mana fragment and zircon are fused using Boltzmann's technique to create a rune crest. Fibers from the mana leaf herb, when placed in the crest, protect the crystallization caused by the illness. Ah, the rest of this is just theory. So in other words, we need a mana fragment, zircon, and a unicorn horn, right? And a mana leaf herb. Then we make something called a rune crest, and attaching that to a key crest will suppress the crystal's activity. Who's going to make that? Well, a dwarf, I guess. 
What is happening to Colette's body? It's called Chronic Angelus Crystallis Inofficius, or Inofficium. It's just like Altessa's diagnosis. It's an illness that causes the entire body to become a Crucius Crystal. Okay, now we have some hope. There's not much time. It says that crystal epi or epidermal crystallization begins within a few months, and the final stages of the disease cause the body to completely crystallize. The internal organs start to crystallize once the epidermis is crystallized, and then finally, the subject dies. I suppose there's no point in trying to mince words. Yes, exactly. Let's hurry. Cute girls deserve to live long. Where are the materials? My company once handled Zircon. If we go to the main Lazareno building, we should be able to find information on it and where it is stored. The mana herb, or mana leaf herb is probably in Heimdall, the elven village. Yes, I think I've heard that name of a plant before when I was a child. But the people of Heimdall forbid anyone that is not an elf to enter the village. Why? Seems there was some trouble between them and humans a long time ago. These days, no one enters without a permit from the king of Tethayala. I wonder if the king will give us a permit? Who knows, he doesn't seem to want to see me. We could try asking Princess Hilda. And assuming we can get the mana leaf herb, what about the mana fragment? What is it anyway? Beats me. In the scriptures of the Church of Martell, there is a passage that says the colossal mana of the great motherland, Daris Carlon, rained down upon the earth in fragments, giving birth to all living things. So it's in Daris Carlon? There's no proof, but... That's the enemy's main base. Let's do that later. First, we'll either go to Heimdall or the Lezareno Company in Altamira. Right? So we have a choice. I guess we have to go ask Princess Hilda, since we're here. The king's resting. If you have urges, business, you should... Oh, where is she? There she is. My father says that he does not want to meet with anyone, but we have to go to Heimdall. The king is the only one that can issue the pass to Heimdall, right? Could you please ask him for us, princess? Zelos, if you insist, I will ask my father. Please wait a moment. Even if we receive the pass, Heimdall is not a friendly village to anyone except elves. I can't say if they'll give us the mana leaf herb. We'll get them to give it to us somehow. This is a letter from my father to Heimdall. Should be able to enter the village with this. Thank you. Princess, you have my thanks. Where's Heimdall, or Heimdall anyway? The Tower of Salvation is located at the center of the world, right south of there. I heard it's surrounded by the Ymir Forest. Okay then, let's go guys. So yeah, I think you can do this in any order. Let's go do a... What's his name's quest first. Regal's side quest, or not side quest, but Regal's Lazareno company thing for the Zircon. I'll carry the wood outside the city. Kratos! Do you intend to fight here? What are you going to use the sacred wood for? You do not need to know. Sacred wood burns several times hotter than normal firewood. Are you going to melt Aeonis? Aeonis is a fictional ore. Yes, so they say. Stop being so mysterious about everything. Wait. Move. I said wait. The more time passes, the less likely you will be able to cure the Chosen's illness. What? Kratos. Hate to say it, but he's right. Let's hurry up and save Colette, okay? Yeah. Ugh. Alright, so as you can see, we don't need to use the sewers anymore. Alright, so we've been playing for a long time now. And uh, I hate to say it, but I'm a little hungry, so I'm going to go stop for now. I've been playing for about three and a half hours. Um, so yeah, going very nicely. Definitely a pleasure to enjoy playing this game again. And uh, when we come back, we'll probably finish it, because after this, I'm trying to think what's coming, with, and I'm not going to say it, but I'm just thinking, I don't think there's too much left after this. I don't, I know we complete this, we do all, we do X, Y, and Z, some stuff happens, and then it's off to the final area, and then that's it, right? So we might beat this game tonight, which will be nice, because I'd like to move on and uh, go ahead and be able to do other stuff. So it's not that I'm rushing it. It's just that, you know, this game is, uh, 
definitely coming towards its natural conclusion. And, uh, I'm enjoying myself definitely playing this game again, so alright. We're going to take a break for now, and I'll see you guys later.